Oops. Well, that particular shot there wasn't a very good shot. And quite often I see golfers doing that shot in the golf course where they, they're aiming one direction and they hit the ball in a different direction simply because the path of the downswing is on the wrong path. So what we really want to do is we, the, we want to fix this over the top shot. In this particular tip, we're, we're going to call this an over the top shot. And invariably what happens uh, initially is someone starts doing that with a club face in the direction the, the path is, it's going to go left. After a little while, they start to manipulate it and the club face stays open. And invariably, especially with the longer clubs, you finish up with a slice shot. So what are we talking about by over the top? Well, I'm going to use this swing guide here, made by Peter Ormsby in uh, South Australia, very good teaching aid. Uh, and it, this is going to highlight the, the, what we call the alignment of the club shaft to the left arm in the downswing is what we're going to be looking at. And uh, so from the top of an ideal backswing, what you'll discover is that the club shaft in the left arm is in the same line or plane. And what we need to do in the downswing is we need to uh, bring the club down so that the club shaft moves in line with this left forearm. And we say then the club is on the right plane or on the right path we call it the A to B path, directly at the ball. And if we do that, we can, from a good grip and a good stance, if we naturally release, the ball will go to our intended target. I would say that the majority of golfers that come over the top, where this club shaft goes out of line with the left arm somewhere in the downswing, it's because they're too scared of hitting out in that direction and they're wanting to guide or steer the club down towards the hole. Because a lot of us are told that we need to make the club head travel towards the flag through the ball. Where in actual fact it's traveling on an arc and the downswing path is definitely not the ball's path to the target. It's a two target game. So when you get to the top of the backswing, what we need to drill in is the correct use of the hands so that they deliver the club head on the right path, making the club shaft move in line with the left forearm in the downswing. At the bottom of the swing, the natural turn of the body, the natural release of hands and arms will square the club face to the ball. So as a drill, for anyone that finds themselves severely coming what we call over the top, whether it's with an iron shot or with a wood, what we want, if we haven't got one of these devices, we go down the grip, go to the top of the backswing, and initially without any body turn, just to get the correct hand and arm action, we just learn to do this. We say thumbs down, or it's a release A to B. We're throwing the club head directly towards the ball, which is not in the direction in which the ball's gonna travel. This is called the hit line, and this will undo this bad habit of coming over the top. So if you just understand that the wrong hand action is this way, the correction is to come down this way. Now once I can do it without any body turn, just naturally add the body turn. And if I hold the club down short, sit up to the ball, go to the top of the backswing, position A, and we just look at it first down here, and then releases out and over the ball. So now watching the ball, down and over. With a little bit more speed, we pick up the blur of the club head going on the correct inside down the line path and back up to the inside. And that would be the correct way to deliver the club head to the ball to give you that straightaway shot. Let me demonstrate. That's gone straight away, just a tad to the left. After that last shot, no wonder it went a little bit left, so I need a little bit more practice. 
Let me do a bit more drilling and see what happens with this next shot. A practice swing. One, two, three. This drill will definitely prepare you to swing the club head on the correct path. One more shot, let's see how that goes. Relax. And there we are. That's the result we're looking for. So to fix that over the top shot, firstly be aware that it's the hands that you need to control. Practice making the club shaft go in line with your lead arm. Firstly, turn your body away to the top of the backswing position and just watch this, practice this a little bit by itself. Then add a little bit more downswing to it. Feel as you do it, let your body turn naturally. Then, have some slow practice swings above the ball, go down the grip. So you're using this end of the stick, the golf grip, to uh, give you a, a reference as to the club shaft's direction, not over the top. A little bit of breeze. One, two, three. And away we go. One last shot to prove that it works. And there it is, pretty well straight over the flag this time. And there you have it how to fix the over-the-top shot.